Hello and welcome to the GBC Productions channel. This is episode 94. In this video, I'll be taking apart a vintage Geiger counter. This one was made by Anton Electronics Labs in 1959. It's the CDV 700 model number 5. We'll also take a look inside of the earphone headset. It has a screw-on connector. If I screw back the collar, you can kind of see the connector a little better. Not much different. There's a plastic cover here that goes over the headphone connector. Here's a closer look at the wand. It has a shutter on it that'll rotate to protect the tube inside. With it open, you can kind of see the tube in there. On the side here, there's a way to test it. In the previous video when I was testing it, I was using this sticker on the side. There's a little bump there in the middle of the sticker. Now open the shutters, turn it on, and hold it there. The needle goes up. The switch has four positions, off, times 100, times 10, and times 1. There's the logo, and some more information on top. Now we'll take a look inside. To get inside, there are these two clips. One here, one at the other end, and it lifts right out. Now in the bottom, a dryer pack, and the schematics. I'll hold it the right way. I'm going to pause for a moment, reorganize, and then we'll start taking a look at the circuitry. This uses five D-cell batteries. I'm going to get the batteries out of here and then take these screws off here. Then we should be able to start seeing the circuitry underneath. It has these aluminum spacers that hold the battery tray up. And it looks to be pretty simple circuitry. Here's a really old capacitor that probably is no good. Both of these should be replaced. And there's a tube here. I'm not going to mess with that. And right in the middle is our four position switch. I'm going to pause for a minute and see if I can get the circuit board out. And here's the other side of the circuit board. And there's yet another capacitor that needs to be replaced. There's also a potentiometer here for calibrating the meter. I'd like to take a look inside the wand but I don't want to risk breaking it, even though I'm sure it probably just unscrews. So I'm going to pause for a moment, and then what we're going to do is take a look inside of the earphone headset. Let me clear things up, I'll be right back. So here's the earphone. It just unscrews. There's a plate here with a little corrosion and then a couple voice calls. Don't forget to subscribe for more, mash that like button, and comment below. Until next time, this is Uncle D from GBC Productions, signing off.